Hi, welcome to the channel, Maths Discovery. I would like to invite you looking at a classic geometry problem, calculating the area of part of a given ellipse. The method introduced in this video is certainly not unique. If you have a simpler one, please let me know by leaving your comments. I will make another video so as to share the knowledge with the others. Given an ellipse, centered at the origin and represented by the equation, x square divided by i square plus y square divided by b square equals 1, where i equals 5 and b equals 3, the ray, starting from the origin and creating with the axis x an angle at 30 degree, cuts the ellipse at the point i. Similarly, the ray, starting from the origin and creating with the axis x an angle at minus 30 degree, cuts the ellipse at the point b. We need to calculate the area made by the arc i b and the origin, painted by color light blue. Let point H be the projection of point A on the axis X, and X A A Y A the coordinates of point A in the plane. One can easily get X A equals O H, and Y A equals A H. As angle H O I equals 30 degrees, we obtain Y I equals X I divided by square root of 3. Also point I lies on the ellipse, it should satisfy the equation representing ellipse. Therefore, it is straightforward to determine the values of X I and Y I. Note here that point I lies in the first quadrant of the plane, therefore, xi and yi are positive. One could in a similar manner determine the coordinates xb, yb of point b. We find here points i, b have the same x coordinate, and their y coordinates are sine opposite. Consequently, segment i, b in the axis, x are perpendicular, and they intersect at point h. Now the area of triangle, OIB can be calculated as a half of the product between OH and IB, and its value is shown on the right-hand side. The funnier part is to calculate the area of the region made by arc IB and segment IB, painted in color brown. Let's denote this region by HIB with an arc overhead. In the area of the region, surrounded by the green border, is denoted by S. One can see that the area of region HIB equals to times of S. Consider now a vertical section in light blue of the region surrounded by the green border. The section locates on the horizontal axis at coordinate x, has an infinitely small width the x and a height y so as to be a rectangle. Its area, denoted by ds, thus equals the product of y and dx, and the relationship between x and y follows the representation of ellipse, e. Accordingly, area s is written as the integral of ds for x ranging from xi to i. To calculate this integral, we change the variable from x to theta by the relationship x equals i times sine of theta. Replacing this relationship in the formula of s, we obtain a simpler formula that depends on theta, ranging from theta i to pi divided by 2. Here theta i is the arcsin of x i divided by i. After some simplifications, we arrive at the result s equals a half of i times b times theta plus a quarter of i times b times sine of twice theta, for theta ranging from theta i to a half of pi. Recall that the area of the light blue region equals the sum of the areas of triangle, oib and of arc, hib. Summing them up with the numerical values leads to this final result. Thank you for watching.